Hello everyone, this is KJ. Welcome back to Subsistence Season 1. Uh, today we're going to try to get to the plane crash before it disappears. Uh, I have no idea if it's going to be there after dawn. Last time I went to prepare for a plane crash, I was at this part of the day and it was there. And when the sun came up, it was gone. So I have a feeling that that is a timing thing. Uh, that and not like a time of day thing like the hunters reappear at midnight these guys seem to come and go uh, based on when they came and went did I just leave the living room light on oh my god it's not gonna work you may notice that I don't in fact uh, drive the uh, ATV around it's not just because I'm terrible at driving the ATV around. It, it's also to do <laughs> it's also to do with um, uh, I'm terrible at driving the ATV around and I don't want to crash. And anyway, it's really hard to get up from the ground when there's a bear on top of you. Like, oh, there's one right there. Oh, for goodness sake. Stop it. <laughs> Let's chase a chicken instead. <laughs> yeah, so we're going to try to get over there, but... Uh, and we are going directly in that direction. I don't think that cordage is going to be done when I get there, but... Oh, look at this. It might be. I had no idea. Oh, look at there's another box on the ground. I had no idea that um, I didn't have any cordage at the main base. And I'm still not going to have cordage at the main base because I'm dragging this stuff to Center Pond with me. I don't have any pickaxes. And I can't make pickaxes. So I don't have any cordage. I also didn't have any planks at home. And if I had thought this through, I would have just gone to Center Pond and made the pickaxes. <laughs> but I didn't think it through, and here we are. I'm driving one-handed. Hang in there. I might live. Oh, I forgot about you. Uh, where's your buddy? I forgot about the hunters. <laughs> hey, there's a hunter base right there. Look at that. I don't know where his buddy is ever at. I know that there are two. I said this on the last one. I know there are two because there was a dead guy bag and that guy. <laughs> and I killed him. Look at all the wolves at the house. Three wolves. We have to the hunters to thank for this insanity. Oh, stop it. Okay. What are you going to do? Uh, let's see here. Uh, stuff to drop. Stuff to eat. Drop. Uh, stop all of this. Uh, drop, drop, drop. Check the map. They're there. Okay. Fire! Smoke on the horizon! Sorry, I, I had a conniption. I'm okay now. <laughs> all this driving one-handed business. It's almost funny. It's not funny at all. I don't know why I said that. Just trying to think of words and stuff. 
<laughs> I didn't, uh, I kind of, I jumped into the game thinking, uh, you know, I'll go pearl diving so that, um, well, you know, not pearl diving at all. That's not even close to what I meant to say. Um, sandstone. Wow. I need glass. I don't have any. I literally don't have any. I've already been to the North Base and know that I don't have any. Something's attacking me. Ow. Loose hair or something. All right. Let's, um, let's see here. Uh, oh boy, they're in a bad position, aren't they? Uh, Chris was telling me that he had, uh, pilots in the same position. So, uh, oh, that was a chicken. It looked like a bear head. The head of a bear. Looked dangerous. All right. Let's see here. I don't want to do this at all, so working out how I want to do this hasn't occurred to me really yet. <laughs> Fire! This offers zero protection. Where the heck are Where are they? I seriously don't see anybody. There's a bear. Oh, he's right there. Okay. Right. Yeah, you know, it's funny. I, just, I still don't see anybody. I'm not going to go running through there like I would if it was a hunter base, though. I'm gonna oh scrap I need that on my other safe not this one it's so hard to keep them straight it's ridiculous it's almost funny because I keep saying stuff that makes no sense there's a wolf oh I didn't do it <laughs> All right, I've got the bloody hands of justice. Where is my quarry? Um, do I see somebody? Oh, there they are. He's on fire! <laughs> oh, I forgot you can't spam those things. <laughs> the other part of that is that a headshot from this gun will kill anything. <laughs> All right, where's your buddy? Ow! <laughs> there he is. <laughs> You're dead too. And you too. Ugh, ow. Oh my god, I don't want to die doing this because the bushes. There he is. no idea where I killed these guys. I wish they were still on fire like they do on co-op. They might be on fire. I don't see them. Oh, for goodness sake. There's a helmet. There we go. Oh, there's uh, rogues, too. Alright. Oops. Don't do that yet. Dummy. <laughs> All right. Takes a long time to put seven bullets into a gun. All right, where's the rogues? I heard wood choppers chopping. Know where the rogues are. 
<laughs> it might be it might be another hunter base. Oh wow, that was a lot of stuff. More than I can carry probably. Uh, here we go. Uh what have I got on me? Uh Oh, I got some uh, whipped cream. Uh, yeah, I've got way too much stuff on me. Um, let me see. I think I can make two of these. Yeah, that clears up two spots. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Wait, did I just see somebody move over there? I might have. I hear a lot of movement. I'll be, I'll be with you in just a moment, airplane. I saw somebody go past. I heard wood choppers. Aha! that distance apparently <laughs> not gonna have room for this there it goes <laughs> oh my goodness gracious uh, oh wait um, no that's a full battery I don't want to waste that what is that uh, ammo casings. Oh, yeah, I just made that, didn't I? All right, well, I can do one of them, and I can't do one of them. Cordage. Ammo casings. More ammo casings. Oh, dear. <laughs> what? Oh, that is medicinal tonic. How many? Oh, it's only one. All right. Well, one medicinal tonic I don't think is enough. No, I need two of them. All right. Did I even look at all three bags yet? I think I did. That is uh, fiber that I just threw away. All right. Medicinal tonic. We're going to have to live without that. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> there, I'll, I'll load up that fire ridiculously and throw that away. <laughs> Shut up, rabbit. Stop laughing at me. Dang it. I'm busy. Uh, yeah. yeah, I need that. Okay. Here we go. Uh, no, bullets. It's one, two, three and that leaves a slot okay back to scrap if I hadn't brought so many gosh darn pickaxes stop it rabbit I have your number I know where you live where the heck go oh there it is <laughs> Everybody's laughing at me. I probably don't need the scrap, but you know, we always need scrap. Never say no. <laughs> Never say no to scrap. Oh my god, I have so much crap on me. I'm I'm dead in between two bases. I could go down to the end of the beach right here and drop off some of this ridiculously unnecessary stuff. Like, what would that be exactly? Um, one cloth, one plate. Seems kind of silly. Nine potassium. I'm just overwhelmed by the amount of uh, ammunition I'm carrying. <laughs> That's a lot of ammo. Oh, I threw away a log and I could have made an arrow. I just am overwhelmed that this airplane is still here. Hey, there's another slot. I 
I put in the I'm not messing around bullets. <laughs> we still need to go uh, over to the other side of the lake today, so maybe I will drop off some stuff on the beach up there. I have that one little emergency uh, blizzard hut. It's not even an enclosed hut. It's just a blizzard hut. <laughs> I think it has a heat pad or a heat pack, rather a heating pad. It has a heating pad. That's interesting. Oh, I already was standing up. Do you ever do that? You crouch down and then you move and you don't know if you're standing up or not. Happens to me all the time. In real life, like I'm really short. <laughs> But yeah, we gotta drop off some stuff before we go look for more bad boys. Hiya! <laughs> Stop it, chicken. I'm lost. I don't know which way to go. Uh, nope. Wait a minute. Wait, I'm lost. Gosh darn it. That away. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't look at me like that, Scrap. You know I'm going to come and pick you up. Uh, on uh, tomorrow's episode, or one of the episodes this week, I literally walk right past a lock crate. Now, mind you, I wasn't looking for lock crates, and I don't have picks on me, but I literally walk right past a lock crate up at Ormazing, and then 10 seconds later say, I can't believe we haven't seen the lock crate yet. <laughs> I mean, for goodness sake, how, is that Rhodes right there? Oh, uh, how bad, oh, no, no, not you, again. I don't think I can jump on that little thing from this direction. I think it's the other way. Oh, that's not a rogue. That's a deer. Shut up, chicken. I need to make this jump. Woohoo! <laughs> Alright, we'll just drop everything, uh... Everything that's not necessary for life here. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't need regular bullets. Hey, there's gonna be an extra battery in here. I need a button that I just push the button it just sorts stuff out for me all right I don't think I need cotton seeds either uh, oh look a claymore that'll be fun hey there's an extra pick that can be here too all right let's go oh boy I'm hot it's hot Got the little heat, wavy, yes, Eagle, you go take care of that wolf for me. Have the little wavy heat thing. Oh, it went away. Good deal. So the game is, uh, uh, yeah, that's the fire I kept going. What a goofball thing to do. I didn't want to waste the wood. Maybe I'll remember <laughs> and I'll pick up the ash. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I could have dropped all the stuff off in this box. Saved myself a trip down the beach. Alright, where were those guys now? Were they at their alley? Oh, that's Mr. Pigglestein. Hello! Hello! So cute! <laughs> <laughs> I have 4,000 fiber at home. Uh-oh. Why I keep picking up fiber, I don't know. Don't know. It's a curiosity. Uh, oh, there you go. That's perfect. Uh, no, no. This is serious business. Uh, I think they're right there. 
Oh, there's a booberry. Oh my goodness. Oh, hey. It's a field of scrappy dreams. Oh my gosh. Oh, I thought I saw something over here. <laughs> I could have avoided the bear completely. There sure are a lot of sticks on the ground. And uh, I know people said, well, they were there before, but they weren't. Like, most of these sticks are new. There were sticks on the ground, but nothing like this. Oh, there's a moose. Hey, moose. Let's see if we can run that moose into the hunter. No, don't go out to sea. There we go. Shooting at him with a pistol. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Dude. <laughs> Don't shoot at mooses with pistols. Doesn't work. <laughs> it's not a good plan. Uh, oh, I don't need that. I need this. Hello, bravo. Oh, bravo, you've got a door. How many pickaxes do I have left? Oh, I put it away. <laughs> well, here we are. Here again. Wait, wait, did I put the... I didn't put the hand grenade away. Let's make this expedient. <laughs> that took off more of it. I, I do love attacking hunters on this save. It's it's almost like even if I did die, I have a complete set of clothing and armor and weapons and <laughs> bullets and everything at home. Although I'm curious now if, uh, even though I've got bed spawns at home, I've got a brand new bed at Center Pond, and I have a bed spawn on that pond, uh, on that uh, bed, on that pond, oh my god, uh, I should be on Golden Pond at this point. Anyway, I have a bed spawn on the Center Pond base too. It's newer, and I wonder which one I'd end up on, but I'm not willing to die to find out, because I'll lose a third of all of those bullets. I can replace them, but I don't really want to. This is, you know, ridiculous. Is there anything else to eat? Oh, I'm not hungry. I'm just thirsty. Oh my good lord. Is it worth just shooting the door down? 33 shotgun shells. <laughs> nothing. <laughs> there's, there's nothing to eat. <laughs> Howdy. <laughs> uh, hey, that's full. And it's got, oh, there's no take all button. I mean, no R button for this. Three ingots, that'll help us with the uh, um, building, you know. Do they have a light yet? No. Nothing I can ruin for them today. All right. A 
Let's see, if I go this way, uh, then I won't be near Stifler, but I will be near all that stuff I dropped off. So let's go cross the bridge. It's getting kind of late, but we did leave the house early. So we might have time to make this extra long trip. I really could decorate this base now, too. I don't know if I want to power up all three bases, though. This is pretty cool. I'm still amazed that we did all of this. Like, it, it's just amazing to me. Oh, there's a rabbit in here. Hey! Stop that! Jerk face. Uh, there's a rabbit in here. Alright, we may as well... Like, you know, we probably can't carry all this stuff. Uh, what do I have on me? Copper and potassium. Here's some more copper. We'll take that. Drop that. Bullets. Uh, cloth. Oh, I've got it in two different places. Goofball. Um, yeah, we can drop that. There's a box full of these. Here we go. Uh, Alright. Uh, what is that? Nine? Oh my gosh. I seriously don't have time for this. <laughs> but we have a flashlight. So it's not like... Uh, you know, uh, we're fine. Okay. It's not like uh, I don't have a flashlight now. Oh, Christmas tree. Oh, Christmas tree. It's only July. <laughs> All right. Well, I think we can make it to Center Pond anyway. Especially with a deer in front of us. That'll chase off all the bears. But not Mr. Pigglestein. Oink. Oink. Sorry, Mr. Pigglestein. I need the scrap. This, uh... The save. I'm uh, season one. I'm really proud of this save. I mean, I learned uh, ninety percent of what I know about this game on this save. <laughs> like I, I learned like the initial how to, what kind of attitude to take to the game uh, from Ono Koho, and that's probably what's kept me alive the most. He hasn't died very much either on his save, which is like three years old. Uh, this one started in some early Alpha 50-ish stage. Oh, there's a bear in the way. Uh, running and gunning. But, uh, yeah, I, I learned so much. And the game has changed a lot, too, since then. I can't stand to watch the early part of it, though, because uh, I think that was before um, I had the good microphone. And uh, I was, like, really dumb and stuff. <laughs> what is it that I need to take? Oh, I should have picked the zinc up. Uh, some of these things are just useless here. I don't know what to take. Oh, it's dark already. Alright. It's uh, 500 meters. 
to our great big beautiful third big base. Uh oh. Yes, I saw you. I was trying to ignore you. It's only another 350 meters. Well, we didn't get any building done today. But I did take out that airplane and Bravo. And I'm pretty happy about that. Uh, I did take a lot of health kits, though. I think uh, a couple of them were, like, out of fear, though, because uh, I forgot that you can't spam them. And uh, I did try to spam them. It's an old habit. <laughs> like, you know one health kit isn't going to be enough, so you do, too. Oh, for goodness sake, Ralph, give up. <laughs> uh, I do need to go uh, diving, and uh, I might just take you along on that trip. We'll have to go back uh, down to the south base in the morning to do that. That bed looks so cool. And, uh, oh, we have a kitchen light, too. That's nice. All right. Well, I'm not particularly hungry, so we'll put that away. We'll put that away. And, uh, look at that amazing, that amazing thing. It's so tall. Like, I know I could put plant beds in here. I don't know if I will, though. I might put one bed with tomatoes but we need to hook up water systems and everything for that and uh, Ross uh, said exactly what I kind of started to say at the at the end was to put the half uh, vertical glass walls right there and then also suggested that I use um, half glass walls uh, in here to separate this area right here like, I don't have any half glass walls right now, but, um, I'm just a, uh, representative of that. Oh, it does kind of go the other way, doesn't it? Would be like that. And then not a whole wall, but a half wall. There's several walls right there, I think. Uh, two or three, maybe? Two of them, I think. All right, you guys, I want to thank you all so very much for coming along. We survived another day. <laughs> I hope you all have a lovely evening. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye for now.